Hi, welcome to my new Nixitube workshop. Today, instead of pictures, I decided to make a short video and show you some of the tooling and some machinery I use for, for my work. So let's start from the biggest machine. This is my glass blowing lathe. It's a beautiful British machine. Uh, it was built in 1968. It weighs over 800 kilograms and it's around 2 meters or maybe over 2 meters long. Here I have a propane cylinder and oxygen concentrator as a source of oxygen. Here is a batch of tubes waiting for sealing and another batch of tubes waiting for some vinyl people. Here I have a vacuum oven. This will be a new pumping system. I'm working on it. Here is a 19 inch rack. There will be all the uh, all the controllers and electronics that will control the gauges and pumps and other, other things, temperature sensors. Here is my good old leak detector. It's a good machine. Again, it's quite old. It comes from France, Alcatel machine. This is the newest addition in my collection of tooling and machines. Uh, this is a laminar flow hood. Uh, it allows me to work in a, uh, a little bit cleaner environment, free of dust. I use it for, for assembly of the inner parts of the Nixie tubes. You can see it here. Here are some systems that will come into the glass envelope. digits and some other ceramic parts and other, other things. This is a spot welder. It's again it's it's perfect machine. You can set profiles for, for spot welding and uh, control the current and timing and other things. Here are the welding pliers that are connected to the to the spot welder valve. This is a new workplace. Uh, here I attach the uh, the sockets to to the tubes. Here is a batch of tubes waiting for for their sockets. Here are the sockets and other parts. And here I have another small room. This is a kind of of chemistry lab. Here is a washing place. I use it for, for washing the parts, all the metal, metal parts, ceramic parts. Here are some mica, mica, mica parts. I use it for cleaning uh, before they are put inside the tube. Ultrasonic cleaners. Here is a station for the ionized water. I have several several sources of, of water of various purity. This is a demi water, deionized water. And this is just a, some storage racks. There is a kitchen oven, I use it as a dryer. So that's all for now, thank you for your attention.